This episode of Techno Buffalo is brought to you by Domain.com. The past eight years, we've seen crazy advancements in smartphones. We've seen multi-touch, on-screen keyboards, full HD screens, and now we are seeing the next evolution of the smartphone. This is Sony's latest Xperia, the Z5 Premium, rocking a ridiculous 4K screen. I'm John Ranger from Techno Buffalo, and let's take a look at all damn pixels. Go ahead and take the lid off this guy. We're gonna halt through the unboxing because mostly just about that ridiculous screen. And here it is, 5.5 inches, 4K with a ridiculous 801 PPI. Real fast, push it off to the side, see what we're gonna have in the box. We got a book, we got headphones, we got a power adapter, and a micro USB cable. Great. Here is the phone. Let's pull this top off. Oh, satisfying and whooshy noises. Uh, the power button lives on the right-hand side. It does have a built-in fingerprint sensor. Let's go ahead and turn this on and see what that 4K screen looks like. So aside from that insane screen, this is a really nicely specced phone from the camera to the battery, and the build quality feels like typical Sony, which suffice it to say, feels really nice in the hand. But the, the big story, I think the only thing to really focus on here is 4Ks, that this many Ks on a screen. So let's look at some video and see what it looks like. Cause looking at text on websites, I don't think you're gonna get sort of the full experience. So Sony's got a few videos sort of put in here uh, by default. So. Let's look together at what 4K looks like on a phone. I figured the only way to show this, at least as close to possible, is to upload this video in 4K. So if you have a 4K monitor or something higher resolution, hit the settings on YouTube and click that all the way up so you can at least experience this as close to true as you can without 4K on a giant 65, 75, whatever size inch screen looks awesome. But seeing it on something five and a half inches is weird. It looks incredible. Uh, the screen here seems to be pretty bright. It almost looks like 3D, stereoscopic kind of 3D without the glasses, because things look so high resolution. Looking at a picture of, I think, the Greek islands, maybe it's the city of Ia, uh, and you can just see everything. Now, of course, you gotta look at content that's filmed in 4K. If looking at normal 1080p content, you know, see what that looks like when we do the review, but hot damn, this looks really, really nice. And whether or not it's, it's a gimmick or something that's actually gonna be useful, I don't know how 4K is gonna affect battery life. I don't know. But just the geek in me to see something new is really cool. Um, screen aside for a quick sec, quick tour around the rest of the phone. Uh, again, you've got that fingerprint sensing power button on the right. Below that, you've got a volume rocker up and down. And you do have a dedicated camera button, which is uh, super nice to have. On the left-hand side, it's where your SIM and removable storage is gonna be. It does support micro SD cards. 3.5 millimeter headset jack on the top. You've got a little lanyard spot if you want to hang some something on there, and then a micro USB for charging. This is, we have a lot of stuff to look at for the review. I really want to try this. Uh, it's based on 5.1.1. Maybe we'll see Marshmallow at some point, but the real story is just the screen. It's probably what we're gonna focus on mostly in the video. But if you guys want to see focus on anything else, let us know. Uh, of course, we'll cover how the fingerprint sensor works and the speakers and the rest of that stuff, but it's all about that screen. Uh, anyway, love to know what you guys think. Leave the comments down below. Let us know what you want us to cover as well. I'm just gonna stare longingly and lovingly at all of those Ks. Until next time, I'm John Ranger from Techno Buffalo. See you guys in the next video. Yo, what are you doing? I need to... Uh, yeah, well, I just, I'm, A, wanted to see how the footage looks on the Z5, because this is in 4K. Uh, I feel and like my, my office needs more, like, hue lights if it's going to be on camera. Yeah. It's functional it looks, in here. It's like me. Not much to look at. Functional. Oh, be nice to yourself. What are I'm, you doing? I'm thinking about registering some dot .sexy domain names. Ooh. Or, or there's dot .tattoo for you and Ron. Yeah. Or you could get a tattoo. I, my wife was murdering me. Oh, okay, okay. Dot WTF. You could, that you could, could do, do that. She could buy that after I got a tattoo. That seems like it would be like really expensive. Hey John. Dot WTF. Yeah. No, it's not actually. If you use the code Techno Buffalo, you will get twenty percent off. So. Wow, really? Yeah, it's on Domain.com. Wow. Wow, I should have known that. I was thinking about domains. I should have been. I should have been thinking Domain.com. When you're thinking domains, think Domain.com. That's.